What's up everybody? I hope you guys are having a good day. I know I am because the new Modern Warfare 2 maps came out and uh I am enjoying them. Um the uh the map I'm playing on today is called Fuel. Um and I think probably because there's a lot of fuel on it, uh such as such as gas. Um like gasoline. Um so watch out for that because it's flammable and will kill you. Um, as will my sniper rifle. I'm using the uh, intervention this game, but uh, this time I threw the uh, the silencer on it instead of FMJ, and uh, I, I think it seems to work in this game. Um, just because this this map is really large, um, and I'm able to hit them from the side and from behind enough, and stay off the radar that uh, I do pretty well. This isn't the best game that I've had out of this new map pack. Uh, I think Carnival, I'm probably the best at Carnival and I've had a few really good games on it. I'll post those as soon as I can. This one was just the easiest to get up. Uh, so that's why you're watching it right now. But look for my other, uh, look for the other ones up soon. This one is probably my second favorite map, and Trailer Park is uh, is close behind in third place. It gets the bronze medal out of out of the three new maps. Uh, so uh, don't be ashamed. Bronze is always good, um, but not when there's only three people running. So basically, um, Trailer Park just uh, it's not very good. <laughs> it's it's not a good map. I don't know. I, I don't mind it too much. It's just like a bunch of random trailers thrown in, and it's like there's like an airplane there. But like, I don't understand how y you have a trailer park by like a crash site, unless an airplane like crashed into your trailer park. In which case, like your life sucks. Like you're already living in a trailer park, and then an airplane just happens to to crash right in your backyard. Like that is not a good week. Um. I don't. That doesn't really make sense to me, but uh, but it's all good. So basically, they threw a bunch of uh, trailers out um, with a nice little swimming pool and uh, and a wrecked airplane. And there's a lot of camping that goes on. People just sit inside of um, people's bathrooms, which seems kind of intrusive to me. But I I don't know. Um, Anyway, th it, there's just a lot of camping on that map. I am rambling about nonsense. Uh, that's okay. That's what I'm here for. You guys listen to it. If uh, if you guys have a problem with it, let me know. And uh, I probably won't care at all. And I'll just do whatever I want. And you guys will have to listen to it anyway. Anyway, this map, uh, Fuel. <coughs> it's the largest map out of the bunch. Uh, that's why I'm sniping on it. And uh, I didn't really like it at m that much at first. Uh, but that was like the first time I played it, obviously, and I did horribly on it. Uh, in this team deathmatch game here, you can see there's a lot of action going out on the outskirts of the map. Uh, that's not really true for uh, the objective games I found. Uh, it just seems like a lot of there's a lot of stuff going on in the middle, like control control for the buildings and stuff, <coughs> and throughout the buildings. Um, it, I don't know. I guess just because you you want to run the objective through the middle I don't know what I'm talking about but uh but on this team deathmatch game uh we seem to keep the other team spawning on the outside uh, outsides of the map a lot and uh I can't talk right now so you'll just have to bear with me um but it seems to work I even rush their spawn which isn't always smart uh I didn't know they were all spawning there but I try and go do my thing with the snipper biffle and uh, I don't have that much success uh, when there's four guys in front of me spawning and two or three of them have painkiller on. Most likely, I don't know, I only hit one guy with painkiller. Anyway, um, so I got this sweet nuke on Carnival though. And, uh, oh, side note, I don't know if you guys knew this. I didn't know this until today. Because uh, the Pavlo, okay, if I'm not mistaken, um, before it would not count towards your higher kill streaks if you had already died. That's just what I've heard and experienced, so it's probably true. 
um, basically, if you if you didn't die already and you got a pave low, it would count towards your next kill streaks. But if you did have a death, uh, then the pave low you got would not count towards your next kill streaks. Anyway, so I was playing carnival and I had died a few times already, and my kill streaks were pave low AC130 nuke just for the heck of it and um it worked the pave low counted for my ac130 and then helped me also get the nuke um so that's interesting i didn't know that uh, i didn't know that they fixed that apparently which is pretty sweet um so that's probably what i'm gonna run from now on pay uh 9 11 25 instead of 7 11 25 it's i figure if i can get seven kills in a row i can probably just get nine kills in a row and the Pavlo is the bomb, uh, just like 90s catchphrases, like the bomb. Uh, but I really like the Pavlo, it's good stuff. Anyway, I'm rambling. You know why I'm rambling? Because I don't even know what's going on in this game right now. I watched this game like twice before, uh, before I decided to do this commentary, and now I decided to not watch it. So uh, I hope you guys are enjoying the gameplay. Um, but I am not enjoying the gameplay right now. I'm just talking because I can. But you guys seem to like it. So I am going to send another, uh, I'm going to start sending videos into Machinima again. I think because the last time I didn't do it properly when I sent them in. And so that's why they failed. Uh, but I think, uh, I have a good chance of get, getting them on there now. Um, I really don't like some of the directors on Machinima, man, like, like, the, there's those guys that play Modern Warfare 2 that post good scores, they're good at commentating, they are charismatic, like myself, and, um, I don't know, they're fun to listen to and watch, but there's other guys that are just terrible, they're not funny, they're, like, British, shh, uh, <laughs> no, I'm just kidding, I don't have, I don't have problems with, like, foreign people. Uh, but some are really annoying. Anyway, so uh, I'll definitely let you guys know if I get on Machinima. That would be pretty sweet. But uh, this game's going to come to a close here. I get one last sweet kill before the game ends. And then uh, it'll end up with myself being 20 and 3. And we'll go on to win pretty easily. Uh, I'll get the, the uh, other games up to you as soon as possible uh, of the new maps. Uh, so be sure to check for those on my channel, and uh, make sure you like this video, comment it, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Peace!